Welcome to this week's Simon. I am Kim. And I'm Jacques of the Scientific Affairs team here at Illumina. Jacques, what do you call an ambitious wasp? A wannabe. Correct, <laughs> although it's harsh being a bee lately. Honeybee colonies are declining worldwide, and many factors likely contribute to it. From environmental stress to bee-specific pathogens, bees get no respite from their hard work as the main pollinators of crops. How do they accomplish this? Is it due to their awesome social skills? Socialization is a main feature in bees, and olfaction has a lot to do with it. Behavioral genomics, through RNA expression in brains and antennae of bees, has revealed a lot about olfaction, social behavior, and health of beehives. Manfredini et al. profiled the brain transcriptomes of bee queens during their mating process. They found differential expression of odorant receptors and odorant binding proteins between mated queens and virgin queens. According to Mondet et al., at least 11 olfactory-related genes are upregulated in antenna tissue of bees that detect and remove broad cells parasitized with varroa destructor mites. This is called varrosensitive hygiene behavior, or VSH, a very specific collective strategy to sanitize the beehive. Did they also see this in the RNA expression analysis? Yes, samples were collected from bees performing and failing to perform hygiene tasks. Incidentally, through their metatranscriptome approach, they found more viral RNA of the form wing virus and varroa destructive virus in bees not performing hygiene behavior, both of which have been linked to bee colony decline. This would have a ne negative impact on the bee's ability to display this type of behavior. Per perhaps other pathogens or environmental factors have a similar effect. I wonder what happens in the wild. Queen bees have to follow odor cues in order to mate. It is a risky flight, considering that olfaction is key. Chakrabarti et al. showed that commonly used pesticides deform antenna tissue and impair olfaction in native Indian honeybees. Olfaction impairment may affect reproductive, hygiene, and other behavior strategies that rely on odor sensing, like the orientation and pollen search. That sure stinks. Bee colony decline seems to be quite a complex issue. Good news is that these studies aim to improve colony health by tackling specific questions, maybe by identifying markers for positive selection of health-related behavioral traits, like BSH to control varroa destructor in beehives. Well, it's time for us to buzz off. We'd love to hear your thoughts about our show or topics you would like us to discuss. Subscribe to our channel and be sure to pass along this exciting research. Until next time, bye. Bye.